motor's free which you don't want to spin it's looking like an armature here pull it out and test it That boy there also gives a lot of trouble on these hammers. That's the speed pickup, the wee taco magnetic pickup. If you ever notice them starting up and stopping, stopping straight away again, probably that wee magnetic pickup smashed needs to be replaced. It doesn't look bad. She's gone. Changing these armatures. Make sure to change the bearing too. That's just to tackle this magnetic strip here around it for picking up the speed rotation. As it actually picks up the speed. Tells the hammer how fast it's rotating. They fail time to, from time to time. It'll shatter and break them, fall apart, the thing will start, run for a second and stop again. That's what it is, it's broke the tackle. And you don't fix. It's easier to take the handle off, but it's not always essential. They're self-tapping bolts, so make sure you go into the original thread, turn them the wrong way first. When she clicks back into the original thread, it makes them a lot easier to put them in. Because if you cross thread them, 
for a self tapper you're just going to be making more work for yourself there's plenty of meat left in these brushes they're nowhere near wore out but you never put an old set of brushes on with a new armature 100 quid for the armature, 15 for the brushes. Just put a new set on along with the new armature. That's a new brush and that's the old one. The old one's going to be conformed to the old armature, the shape of it. The new one's more conformed to the shape of a new armature. Plus the wee ridges help it better and a wee bit better. So that'll arc away with it. And if you put on the old brush, so she'll arc whenever she's starting to run, which is never going to be a good thing on a brand new armature. So I always just swap out the brushes too. And that cap as well is actually pressing down on that bearing. It's essential that it's on before you run the machine. By like tightening this screw up, you can actually see I push this armature down a little bit more until it beds home. And if that's not on, whenever you start the armature, or start the motor up, the fan will actually be rubbing off the air deflector inside the machine. And then it'll melt and stick together. And you'll have more problems. Start her up beforehand. Spot on. If you had to put on the old set of brushes onto that, you would see a little bit of sparking. Which is never going to be a good thing.